The Research Center for Toxic Compounds in the Environment, RESITOX, is an independent center operating within the Faculty of Science at Masaryk University in Brno, Czech Republic. This modern research and educational institute collects and makes available new information on chemical pollution in the environment and explores the effects of such contamination on the environment, including on cells, organisms and whole ecosystems. Uh, the Resetox, or the main scientific goal, was established around 1988 and the whole time we are working with the fate of the chemicals, it means that with, generally with the chemical pollution of the environment, with special focus on substances which are persistent, stable, toxic and uh, represent a potential risk for the human and wildlife. Resetox is composed of four research programs, environmental chemistry and modeling, organic photochemistry and supramolecular chemistry, protein engineering, and ecotoxicology. These are supported by advanced research infrastructure centralized in three core facilities and two application units. These link Resitox's innovation potential with the needs of the application sector. This structure also facilitates collaboration with stakeholders from governments and industry in order to transform research into practical applications and ensure the marketing of Resitox's expertise. Resitox has been included in the Czech Roadmap of Large Infrastructure for Research, Development and Innovation, endorsed by the Czech government in 2010. Resitox research infrastructure operates in an open access mode. Resitox facilities and expertise are openly accessible to the external research community and stakeholders both nationally and internationally. External users particularly request the use of the Trace Analysis Laboratories, the Genesis Information System, and the ELSPAC Epidemiological Database. Research reports and scientific articles are not the final outcome for Resitox researchers, but rather the beginning. The next step is to put the findings into practice in industry, health protection, or legislation. Blushmid laboratories are focused on research and engineering of dehalogenases. Dehalogenases are enzymes which can cleave halogenated compounds. We search for new enzymes with new properties and then we modify them, improve them by tools of protein engineering. Dehalogenases has not only a great research potential, but there is a broad possibility for biotechnology applications. One of the examples can be a biosensors, this one, which we develop in co collaboration with Czech company PSI. Thanks to uh, newly constructed dehalogenases, these enzymes are sensitive to detect toxic halogenated compounds in environment. Significant international research cooperation and multinational projects bring specialists from all over the world to Resitox. As a result, the centre communicates mainly in English, as international researchers and students constitute 25% of its staff. I was working in, in Norway in a research institute, and two years ago I met Jana Klanova, our current director, in a conference in Milan, and she mentioned to me that Resetox was uh, recruiting internationally, and eventually, about a little bit more than one year ago, I moved here with all my family. What attracted me was basically the possibility of uh, having uh, good funds, freedom, and flexibility of developing independent uh, background basic research in my field. What is Resitox aiming for in the future? Our center celebrates its 30th anniversary this year and it is always a reason to look back and think about the history because those who don't know the history of the center cannot really learn from the previous mistakes and keep repeating them over and over again. We are very proud of the people who worked in the center before us. We are proud of our current success and we keep looking into the future that is full of the challenges. Biggest of all for us is a human health and assessing various factors that are related to the human health. You can meet Resitox researchers too. They regularly sample atmosphere, water, soils and other environmental compartments in the Czech Republic and in other countries through Resitox monitoring networks called MONET. In addition, Resitox organizes educational activities and events for schools, competitions, open door days and summer schools for both students and specialists. 
The centre also participates in activities to raise awareness about science and the environment, such as science fairs, science and technology days, and public science nights. Come visit us.